Hey guys, uh, let's talk about the ice bucket thing for a minute. I think the general, like, global consensus is, okay, we've seen it, we've seen it all, they're getting kind of repetitive and, like, get over it, uh, but then you get called out, like, personally, by your schmuck cousin, and you're like, okay, well now I can't not do it because then I'm that guy that doesn't do it. Um, let's cover some things. From what I understand, you have to donate $20 and cover yourself in ice, or $100 and not. So anyone that just like dumped water on their head and was like, I did it, yay Lou Gehrig's disease. It's, no, you didn't You didn't do anything. You owe 20 bucks and you might be a terrible person. Um, so I'm gonna do that. The other thing and the reason why my cousin is terrible is because I'm here right now. This is where I am all alone in a hotel room. He picked the three days a year that I actually work uh, to, have me do a pretty convoluted setup, um, but I think I can do it, and we're gonna do it. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go on a little journey. Uh, I had two options, either the intimacy kit <clears throat> or uh, the ice bucket bag. Uh, I don't wanna get charged $50 for the intimacy kit, though I'm sure it would work. Uh, this is my bathroom. This is a bucket of ice. It's not enough. I get it. So it's just I'm gonna okay. Okay, see that's that's as cold as that goes. And then so that's cold. Here we go. Chris Patlack and your beautiful hair. Brad Dunn for laughing at me when I was in Lake Michigan, freezing while we were making that movie, and Dan Svoboda, and you have to use GoPros, Dan. Ah!